Texas, Huntsville. Awesome, awesome. Hey. Uh, I, uh, I actually called in just uh, to share uh, some things that I learned when I was in Christian school, actually. I was in, uh, I was in a private Christian school until uh, the middle of eighth grade when I got expelled. Not for any sort of atheist thing, but uh, we won't go into that. Well, whatever it was, it rocked. So, <laughs> Congratulations. Yeah, good thing that I got out when I can. I'm now going to public school, have many more friends, and most of them are atheists or some other, <laughs> some other form. Uh, but uh, one thing that uh, I still laugh about today was something that was taught to us in our science book. Mm. Uh, we went over the whole like creation of the universe thing in science, uh, mm. and evolution was like debunked because of like strange arguments that uh, like about mm. horses and varying numbers of ribs and everything, but. Um, trees that go all the way through the fossil layers, right? Pygmies and dwarfs. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't, I don't remember dwarfs. anything about trees through fossil layers. But uh, anyway, stupid like, stuff. <laughs> they had uh, they had the definition of uh, the word atheist in the in the in the science book, which mm. I found odd. And their definition wasn't somebody who didn't believe in a god. An atheist was a person who hated the fact that there was one. <laughs> Hmm. People unclear on the concept. Hmm. Yes, yes, an atheist was someone who hated the fact that there was a god, which I find very, very odd. And that's why I didn't <laughs> identify as an atheist at first. It's like because, well, I don't hate the fact that there isn't one. I, just, I don't think there is one. Oh, that's it's actually one very clever to ch sort of use that definitional thing on people who don't know better to try to keep people from from coalescing around the concept. Mm. Yeah, good one, yeah. Christians. <laughs> That's <laughs> funny. That reminds exactly. me exactly. And uh, uh, another thing that I thought was kind of funny is like uh, they presented the idea that like why plants have thorns is because of like of the original sin and all that. Um, and uh, like if if uh, Adam and Eve had not uh, committed the original sin, then uh, there would be no plants with thorns. But how would like cacti survive because, right? Like because like in, because they can't have broad leaves because water will just evaporate too quickly. Of course. Like, so all Science. deserts be way doing it wrong. Nothing yeah. anywhere. That's funny stuff. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Well, thanks for that insight into and, the world of Christian education. And you've reminded me, I do actually have in my possession a, a Christian school textbook that a friend of mine who was in your circumstance when she was a teenager, she went a couple of years to a Christian school, like, and she gave me this. It's like, you have to see this. So I'll try to bring it on some show. Okay. Oh, yeah. I, was, uh, I was there until, from kindergarten up till halfway through eighth grade. <laughs> wow. Well, you got well, out when the getting was good. So. You made it. Good luck to you, man. Thanks for calling. Yeah, you got to run. Take care. Thank you very Bye. much.